back again. Good morning guys, how are you doing? And welcome back to another video. And well guys, today, um, yeah, it's a mad one. So the OGs of you guys on the channel all will know Ben, right? Surely you guys remember him. Blonde hair, a cinematic master, and just overall an amazing friend. Anyway, let's get to the point. Ben went to uni, as you guys know. I don't know if I vlogged when I went up there. I, met, I don't think I did. I went up there a little while ago. He went to uni in London and now he's coming back home for the week because it's half term. Like you guys know that I'm off uni for half term. Ben's also come home from uni for half term. So he's here. So I'm going to be seeing Ben today. Um, probably just do some really cool things like back to old times. Maybe go for a drink at Weatherspoons. And then probably like get some cinematics on the new gimbal because Ben was a master of the old gimbal. It'd uh, be interesting to see how he manages the Ronin. And yeah, let's cut to it. Well, the funny thing is, when the uh, when the builders are here and working on the roof, you have to pass cups of tea out of the window. Guys, this is quite exciting for me. I haven't seen Ben in a long time, and Ben was like my closest friend. Um, and it's probably one of the friends that I can just trust the most. Um, just because. The fuck? Why don't the car keys work? But anyway, guys, Ben was one of the friends that I could probably trust most out of like anybody, um, and still is. Um, obviously, when Ben went to uni, I tried to push and make a few more friends because, like, obviously, James works a lot, um, so I don't often get a chance to see James. Um, like, James is about when I'm not, and when I'm not about, James is about. And, uh, yeah, Ben obviously went off to uni, so it's a little bit harder for me to go down to London to see him, um, which is when Connor came in. And it was a, as long... As well as, like... I don't know. As well as like your mates going off to uni, it's really, really kind of like, you say sad, but it's like, you're happy that they're going off to uni and you're happy like that everyone's going off and doing something really cool with their life. But at the same time, it feels like they're sort of disappearing from your life. But if that didn't happen, I wouldn't have met great people like Connor because I wouldn't have put out and put myself out to meet more people and meet new people like him. Um, and it was amazing because me and Connor just gel really well because we both have a big interest in music and film and love it. So as life goes on, it, you kind of just make new friends, I've figured, and it is the best thing ever. And uh, catching up with an old friend, I say an old friend, not a friend that I'm not friends with anymore, but one of my um, OG schoolmates is probably one of the coolest things ever because I just haven't seen them in ages. So without further ado, let's head off. I've uh, got to my grandma and granddad's where I've been, where I'm parking, and the hedge has just scratched the shit out of my car. Um, brilliant, loving it. Brilliant start to the day. So annoying because I got to park close to the hedge because literally there's no space otherwise. It's a really thin road, um, so you got to park right up to the hedge in order for like bin lorries and stuff to come down the road as well. Oh my God, it is a nightmare. But it's all cool. Take these. And let's go and see Ben. And well, here comes the man himself. There he is. All right, so we're back in Morrison's for old time's sake. Old time's sake. Good old old time's sake. <laughs> Me and Ben haven't been in here for a long time. When we used to come in on like the daily to go and stock up on our supplies. I'll let you get, oh it's ginger beer for it's cider. Right, so we're in Costa. Um, after this we're probably going to drive somewhere exotic. Well, not exotic. Somewhere, somewhere cool and get some cinematics with the gimbal because 
you know, Ben, the cinematic master, has returned and we uh, need to bring back the brilliantness and then we'll probably go back and edit that and watch Big Mel. It's going to be a good evening. And yeah, sounds good. Sweet. <laughs> Right, so me and Ben have just come to Chroma of all places spontaneously and found the windmill. <laughs> yeah. Really out, just out of nowhere. <laughs> it's mad. <laughs> it's like, where even are we? <laughs> Mental. church farm we don't really know why we were just we we're going on a little drive and then we came across somewhere called chroma i thought it was in norfolk turns out we have a chroma here in hertfordshire as well so uh, if you're going to chroma in norfolk make sure you sat nav set for norfolk not hertfordshire because well it was pretty nice there and now we've uh, ended up at church farm and um, i remember with oddly something like that um not a great deal here but we're going to explore, get some uh, more cinematics and uh, yeah, let's see what we can find. Mm -hmm. 